about an hour from India's IT capital Bangalore, the RV Government Boys High School in Husu prepares to host a unique and special event. Close to 200 boys and girls from neighboring rural schools are gathering to be trained as young instructors for the Agastya International Foundation's Science Fair. As the Agastya team trundles into the school campus in their mobile lab and begins to set up its apparatus, the excitement is palpable. The science fair is scheduled to begin the following day, but the children can barely wait to get started. Agastya instructor Manjunath begins to work his charm, switching effortlessly between four languages and easing the children into the exciting world of practical science. Over the next few hours, he will demonstrate over a hundred simple experiments. You are getting day and night. Okay, now. For science buffs like Nitya and Vipola, this is a chance to go beyond the four walls of their classroom to understand what makes the world go round. Today they must learn, so tomorrow they can teach at the science fair. It's an exciting and challenging opportunity and there is no dearth of volunteers. On the big day, close to 2,000 children make their way to RV Boys High School. The young instructors are ready with nearly 200 scientific experiments designed by Agastya educators. Wherever possible, basic scientific concepts are broken down into innovative experiments that can often be replicated by the students in their own environments using low-cost tools and equipment. For the visiting students, it is a fascinating and intense learning experience that they can apply to the world around them in practical ways. In teaching other students through hands-on experiments, the young instructors also deepen their own knowledge and develop exceptional communication and leadership skills. Agastya's science fairs have succeeded in shifting the focus of science education from rote-based learning towards practical skills and creativity and have sparked the imagination of millions of children. But this is only a part of the vision that sustains the organization's efforts. At Kupam, a statue of the venerable sage Agastya presides over 170 acres of Agastya International Foundation headquarters. Rural children from Karnataka, Andhra Pradesh and Tamil Nadu visit the Agastya campus to be initiated into a world of learning and curiosity, of magic and discovery. The whole focus is on sparking creativity and we use science, experiments, the hands-on method of learning as one of the most effective ways of doing this. It's not just science, it's also the arts, it's ecology, it's scalable, it's replicable to a very large number of disadvantaged and vulnerable children. And the important thing we're trying to do is not so much to teach subject matter as to get children to question, to learn to think about cause and effect and find answers for themselves. This generates inner excitement, it generates momentum, the whole process of awakening curiosity. That's what we are about. Maximum 
ప్రైవేట్ స్కూల్స్లో ల్యాబ్ ఫెసిలిటీలు లేదు వాళ్ళకి ఒక్క తీరి చదవడము అది ఏమో అది అది ఎట్లుంటుంది ఏమో వాళ్ళకి ఏమి చేసి కూడా లేదనమాట చదివినాము రాసినాం చదివినాము రాసినాం అంతే కొన్ని రోజుల తర్వాత పూర్తిగా మర్చిపోతూ ఉంటారు కానీ ఎప్పుడైతే మొబైల్ ల్యాబ్లో వెళ్ళిన తర్వాత ఈ ఎక్స్పెరిమెంట్ పలానా లెసన్లో ఈ ఉంది ఇది ఇంత ఈజీనా అనే ఒక ఫీలింగ్ వాళ్ళకి వచ్చిందంటే వాళ్ళు లైఫ్ లాంగ్ ఆ ఎక్స్పెరిమెంట్ మర్చిపోరన్నమాట ఒక్క పిల్లవాడు ఒక్క ఎక్స్పెరిమెంట్కి పూర్తిగా టోటల్గా అర్థం చేసుకొని దానిపైన అతను ఏమైనా చేసినా కూడా అతను ఫ్యూచర్లో ఏదైనా కనుక్కోవచ్చు లేకపోతే అతని సైన్స్ పైన ఎక్కువ ఇంట్రెస్ట్ పెరిగి అతనే కూడా తయారు చేసుకోవచ్చు అనమాట మిల్లీ ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ అన్నీ కూడా For children of all ages, the arrival of Agastya's mobile lab in the village is an eagerly awaited and momentous occasion. From within its doors emerge tools of wonder and marvel, which teach simple lessons that help them understand their world better. Hey, pay ke talane check karein jaise thana chahiye? Pay ke thano. Yekada sparsha gyanam kante kora sabda mane di. Ye matandi? Veganga veli orik matandi? మెదడుకు వెళ్ళి చేరుతా ఉంది కాబట్టి కరెక్ట్గా చెండ్లు ముచ్చుతాను ఈ పని ఎవరు చేస్తున్నారు రా ఇక్కడ రా ఇక్కడ ఎవరు చేస్తారా మ్యూజిక్ ఎవరు 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 Agastya's instructors have mastered the art of storytelling and their lessons are no less than magic shows. Balram also sees a responsibility beyond his role as teacher. In these villages, he is also an agent of social change. కొంత మంది పిల్లలు ఎక్కువగా ఈ విలేజెస్ మేడం మూఢనమ్మకాలు అనేవి ఎక్కువ ఉంటాయి కర్పూరాల అంటించి నోట్లు వేసుకోవడము లేకపోతే దిష్టిలు తీయడము లేకపోతే మ్యాజిక్ షోలు ఇవన్నీ వీటి యొక్క ప్రభావం పిల్లలపైన ఎక్కువ ఉంటుంది ఎప్పుడైతే మొబైల్ ల్యాబ్లో వెళ్తున్నామో మేము ఒక్క సిలబస్లో ఉండే ఎక్స్పెరిమెంట్సే కాకుండా పిల్లలకి మూఢనమ్మకాలు కూడా పోవాలి సైన్స్ అంటే ఏమి అనే దాని గురించి మేము ఎక్స్పెరిమెంట్ రూపంలో వాళ్ళు చెప్పడం వల్ల ఏమవుతుందంటే మనం ఇన్ని రోజులు చూస్తూ ఉన్నింది ఈ సైన్స్ ఏనా ఈ సైన్స్కి చాలా పేర్లు ఉన్నాయి మ్యాజిక్ అని ఇదంతా కూడా సైన్స్ అని పిల్లలు బాగా ఇష్టపడతారు అనమాట Agastya excites the kids about science. There is a whole array of experiments like a like a buffet and they are sort of sampling all the different aspects of science. And the children as they watch what seems to be a magic show, they get really excited. They feel like wow, you know, this is fun. Learning is fun. Science is fun. Science is something which is not something that I only look at but I participate in. I have to become a part of that whole process. How do I become a part? I learn how to observe. I learn how to ask. I learn how to do. Agastya is very particular that the kind of equipment that is used, kind of experiments, the models which are made are very reachable. They are very from everyday things. They are inexpensive. They are low cost. So we can, uh, even the rural kid can think, I can go home and try this, you know. Maybe I can pull out something and I can try this. Some of them actually said that I used to think that inventions and discoveries were not for me. Only some people could do it. But after seeing Agastya's experiments, I feel it's not that difficult. Maybe I too can discover. Maybe I too can invent. I think that's a big thing to say. a big change to occur to bring home the fact that there is there, there is an inventor in you there is a discoverer in you and we are trying to draw that out not all scientific concepts are that simple though einstein idra bage samshodana madida but agastya is ably supported by the best minds in the country bringing their learning and experience to young rural kids as well as their teachers teacher training is a crucial aspect of spreading the scientific temper we have to find out whether the rural teachers really have understood the basic sciences in the correct way so that they can impart the knowledge to the children appropriately so what we try to do is to bring a group of teachers 
and with the experts in the fields available give them a basic uh, course of uh, various subjects uh, in physics, chemistry, mathematics. What are the various experiments which are needed for them to understand things better and specifically devise those experiments coupled with the theoretical explanations which have been given earlier, they come out with uh, a better understanding to impart the education to the children so that the force multiplier effect comes in. You teach one teacher, he teaches 20 children, you teach another, he teaches another 20 and so on. Computer and the other one is the one who 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 is the one Agastya's Ecology Initiative is driven by noted environmentalist Dr. A. N. Yelapa Reddy. Dr. Reddy's passion for all flora and fauna ignites the imaginations of visiting rural students. Dr. Reddy's use of highly scientific yet simple methods of restoring the ecology of the Agastya campus has borne stunning results from land that had been subjected to many decades of severe degradation. With a very gentle manipulation, the manipulation of uh, forming few contour bunds and few saucers, few check dams here and there and introduction of some tree species uh, for the animals or birds to come here. In creating this habitat, Agastya's vision has catalyzed the growth and revival of a robust gene pool from the dormant roots of more than 200 species of plants thought to be nearly extinct. Agastya International Foundation's efforts to revitalize rural education has nurtured another unique and precious pool of young minds that can only provide sustenance for the future. Despite significant progress over the last 50 years, it remains true that around 70% of the country's population, especially its rural citizens, do not engage fully in the progress of the country. Now this must change, and it can happen through the power of education. At Augusta, we have a vision of creative and networked learning communities spread across the country. Communities which share information knowledge and creative power, communities which produce leaders and problem solvers. What is required for a child? An appreciation for nature, an appreciation for every molecule which nature struggles. If we exhaust it, the future generation will suffer. And to rebuild that, it will take hundreds of years. Is there a substitute for the water? Is there a substitute for a breathable air? So once if the children know the value of how the nature manages resources, and if we just copy some of these things in our life, I think uh, most of the problems of the world today we can solve. <music>